Hi, I'm Tony Swinehart with MCP's Full Court Press, brought to you by Spectrum Health Huntington Hospital's Orthopedics. Today we are here with Andrew Quinn, who is a Mason County Central senior, and he recently is a confirmed state champion at wrestling. Congratulations, Andrew. Thank you very much. Okay, so <laughs> you have been wrestling probably since first or second grade. Is it like eight years old that you can start? Um, I'm pretty sure it was like four or five, actually. Oh, wow. Okay, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So a very long time. I'm, I'm actually about to turn 18 and like nine days or something like that, the 17th. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow, and another adult. <laughs> and you're actually the youngest of four boys. Yes. Um, Dave and Kristen are your mom and mm -hmm. dad, and they've been, um, you know, wrestling, like your dad wrestled for many, many years, mm -hmm. and as well as all three of your brothers. Now, how many of them went to state? Um, so all three of them went to state, and all three of them did place. The oldest placed twice. I believe that would have been... The year 2012 and 2013, he got sixth and seventh. Matt, the second oldest, got fourth. And then Zach, the third oldest, the one right above me, got third and fifth. Okay, so we are the first one, yep. the baby, and mm -hmm. the first one to get the state champ. Yep. And what was your weight class again? 285, heavyweight. 285. Mm -hmm. And I know that there were a couple of other local... I don't know if they're going to be in our division any longer, but there was other a couple of other kids that went to state that you were familiar with. Right? Um, Landon Gorberg, I believe was his name. He was from uh, Ravana. He was in my bracket. Okay. There's a bunch of kids from Whitehall that made it, but they're in Division II. A um, okay. couple of kids from Hart that made it. Mason Cantu was one of them. He ended up getting second. They're Division III. Okay. Um, Nikolai Kor, I don't believe, made it, but he was... Um, Division two as well, I believe. Okay, and we are our division five right we, now. We are four. We are four. four yep. We are going to five, I believe. I, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I'm a senior. I'm not, uh -huh. Yeah. So do you think you'll go anywhere wrestling? Um, probably not for wrestling right now, but I'm looking into some track. Uh, Saginaw Valley okay. is oh, yes. one You're that we're looking at now. for track and field. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And so what do you do in track? Shot, put, and disc. Yeah. I don't run. Figured. I don't run. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of figured. And you've also done, haven't you gone to state for those as well? Oh, uh, yes. I was runner-up last year in shot. Okay. I didn't make it, make it for disc, but I had a bad day at regionals. <laughs> oh, well, yeah. and that does happen. Mm -hmm. But obviously this past weekend when you won the state championship, you had a great day. So. Mm -hmm. How, and you won by pin, mm -hmm. which is pretty major, especially when you get to state. Mm -hmm. So how long did it take you to pin him? I believe it was like three and a half minutes. So the first full two minutes, okay. the first full two minute period, we were on our feet the whole time. And then I got the first choice and I went down. And I think he held me down for about a minute. And then I got up and did the whole turnaround thing and pinned him. So what was it like? I'm sure all your family was there. So what was that like to have all your brothers there watching and your mom and dad and everybody? Oh, it was pretty cool. I've had all three of my brothers and my dad in the room wrestling all year long, helping with stuff. So um, definitely couldn't have done it without them. So just them watching was, I cried a lot. <laughs> it, was, it was pretty emotional. Yes. Um, so yeah, it was pretty cool. And just looking up after I won and seeing them all on their feet and yes. it was just pretty cool. <laughs> You're going to make me a little too right. <laughs> there has only been five people that have gone in one state in wrestling for Mason County Central. Mm -hmm. You are one of the five. Mm -hmm. So that also has to feel really good. So who are the other ones that you know of? Um, that I know I know of three others, Jacob Shoup being the most recent, um, Bob Cameron being the next, and then Josh Elvis Duffer being the one before him. Okay. And then I believe there was one more gentleman that was probably back, I believe, in the 70s. Yes. Correct? Yep. So that in itself is quite an accomplishment mm -hmm. to only be one of five people that has ever gone to state. Mm -hmm. So they had to feel good too. Yep. Yeah. And track is coming up. Don't you mm -hmm. guys, you start practice this uh, Next week. week, yep. Okay. So good luck. Thank you. Because maybe you will go to hopefully. state. Hopefully, yeah, we'll see. twice. Well, in, hopefully. In the same senior year. How <laughs> awesome would that be? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Any final thoughts on anything like what it felt like? Other than being very emotional, I mean, it's got to feel really good. Yeah, definitely feels really good. Yeah. Getting recognized all, all over now, so yes. <laughs> that's, pretty, that's pretty cool. I'm sure that is. And 
I do have to ask, because this is something that came back in style just recently with the mullet. Does your mom or dad give you any grief about that? Um, everybody gives me grief about it. Uh, it. It was supposed to get cut off on Sunday, but person who was supposed to cut it off got sick Aww. so it, it should be coming off this weekend it's oh. it's really annoying <laughs> <laughs> really annoying oh well congratulations again thank it's you it's been wonderful to have you accomplish something like this when you've been wrestling for as long as you've had and your whole family has been a mm -hmm. wrestling family so um kudos to you thank you yeah and for more news go to masoncountypress.com